Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to DVD Ed Impera with yours truly, your first Spear Primus Pilots. We are back in the Roman Empire and we are fighting quite a few wars. Uh, one with Rhodos, one with Parthia. Here, Parthia. Parthia is quite strong. And then we also, of course have this war with, there they are, Bithynia. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna get going. Now let's 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 I think we're at the start turn. It's been a while since I last played. Uh, and we did win a major naval battle, I do believe, against the Rhodos. Those are the those are the factions we're fighting, right? No, as a uh yeah, that's a client, then we have Bithynia, then we have you for some reason. Client as well. Parthian clients, I think. Then we have Rhodos, yeah. Uh but I think we're doing quite well. I really do think we're doing quite well. Now let's remind each other of the uh victory conditions here. Uh I just went in and, and, and checked real quick. Now we need the only thing we need to do is get more <laughs> get more naval units. Now I do think we can do that. That is not going to be an issue. Look at our money. Look at our income. Uh, and we need to get the uh, province of Syria, which is this province over here. Uh, we are actually quite close to that. We already have Samosata, which is already a bit of Syrian land. Uh, but then we, of course, need to get uh, Tarsos, Antioch, and um, Tapsakos, which is over here. Now, I don't want to go and rush in right now and take this. I don't want to do that. Because we still have a war with Egypt to fight, which is one that I absolutely would like to fight in this campaign, and I still want to mop up this thing, uh, this whole Asia Minor, uh, Asia Minor bit. Um, so yeah, that is that is absolutely something that I still want to do before we we start moving towards Syria. So what I think we're going to do here is we're going to see what the Parthians are actually doing, because I have no clue what they are doing. They could be anywhere as well. I would like to have Trapezos though, because that is part of our that is a little bit of a, a province still. Um, so we're going to have to look at Parthia for a bit, uh, and we're going to have to look at Asia Minor for a bit, and then we're going to, at some point, hopefully, once the legions are back to full strength, we're going to be starting that war with Egypt. So that's basically basically where we are at right now. We're not going to just invade here and be done with the campaign. I don't want that. I want to establish a little bit more of the old borders. Just a little bit more of the old borders. That would be very much fine with me. Right, let's get to it. Let's get to work. There is work to be done, eh? In the famous words of Saruman. Um, or there is work to do. What did he say? There is work to do, I believe. Doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Let us uh, grab some more perks here for you, my dear Navy. Yep, that is good. What can you get here? I don't want to. I don't want to do it. I want to uh, use this fleet to besiege... Uh, or not besiege, I want to use this fleet to... Well, we could actually attack Rhodos with this fleet. That wouldn't be an issue. That wouldn't be an issue at all, because we have... Uh, we have quite a few... Yeah, 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 yeah. We have quite a few... Um, what's it called? Missile... Uh, 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 artillery ships. There we go. I have a new coffee machine, by the way, which is bloody amazing. It's bloody amazing. It's so bloody good. So, let's uh, let's take a look here. I also need to set a timer. So we could cheese this with the uh, artillery that we have. I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to maintain the blockade because I, I want to step away from cheese as much as I can. I'm going to set a nice big fat timer and then we are going to move this fleet over to here. No, no, that is not what we do. Uh, we need you to move over to here, I think, so that we can get more Quincha Reams. Let's just get right over that border. And I do believe we can get uh, four here. Yeah. Oh, uh, Ebora. Right? It was... Uh... Oh, God. In the comment section, it has been mentioned that there is a double... What was it? What was it? There we are. Wait, that's not a double... Um... Oh, never mind. Right? In the comment section, it was mentioned that there was a double uh, military building in Ebora. I do believe. Maybe I'm mistaken. I can't reach my notes right now, which is annoying. I'm terribly sorry about that. Because my left... Uh, no, it doesn't matter. Um, but that is not a double double military building. That is a iron mine. Iron works. Well, that's solved. That's good. That's good. But thank you for bringing it up, because uh, I tend to sometimes I tend to overlook some things, like double military buildings or uh, an, uh, a stance that somebody is still in, or uh, a lot of mercenaries 
you know, drawing money from our treasury, stuff like that. I tend to overlook some things sometimes. So you you absolutely have to keep me uh, keep me on my toes on that. So very much appreciate it because it tends to happen quite a quite a lot. Uh, what do I need to do with you? I kind of need to get you over to here. Start moving towards Pergamon. We don't need to be in Pergamon just yet, but let's start moving towards it. Uh, you need to be... Yeah, you don't really need to do anything. Uh, I would like to have this spy over here and move you back a little bit, because I want to know whether there's any Egyptian armies over here. Uh, then we'll grab the other spy here. I need to know what the... Stop it. We have two spies over here. That is actually a very good thing. You're a very good spy as well, so let's sabotage this army. That is very good. We don't want you to move, buddy. Let's take a look at the Dessa. Because I would not mind using one of these legions to start doing something at the Dessa. That is actually the Emperor. I want to get rid of these troops. Um, I would like to grab a little bit more replenishment. I would like to have a Dessa, though. How are you feeling about this war? Fine, you're feeling fine about this. Now, we can't get to Edessa in a single turn. I'd, I'd rather get to Trapezus. Which is also where we can get in a single turn. But then we have to be aware of any... Okay, we could get you to Koron. Which is what something that I would not mind. Let's get you to gather some more intel here. That does not reveal anything. Um, we are still fighting. Man, we need to... What, let me check the political situation here real quick, because uh, I don't know what's happening. Uh. Now, Iconion is a military ally of them, but we I do you believe we just... Speak yeah, we just pieced out with it, them. But... Which is okay. Now, I would like to take Mycia. Mycia has uh, two settlements. One over here, one over here. If we if we take them on, we need to take both settlements in one sweep. Um, it's also worth noting that they are defensive allies with Egypt. Or maybe even military allies. I, I, didn't, I don't know. Maybe maybe I read that wrong. I don't know. Uh, we need to get Trapezos up, though. That is something that we definitely need to do. And then we need to get some replenishment and some recruitment with the Emperor. Now, these numbers are not as good as they should be. Uh, before we make this attack, though, I need to check the other spot. You need to stay where you are. You actually got a level, which is good. Uh, let's use that. More public order is always good. That is always good. More growth is always good as well. Do we have something that uh, takes away from Empire Maintenance? Yes, we have that. So that is good. Uh, yeah, now we can just start moving, I guess. So let's, let's move to... Do we need to have... This guy over here, I guess we do. It's nice to have him there, though. We need you here. Okay, then we have another one here, Budigala. What happens if we take you out of Budiga If we take you out of this province? Because I'm, I'm not sure whether I want to have. Yeah, we can probably get you out of here and start building up another legion to send to the east. Because we're mainly fighting in the east at the moment. And I would not. What level are you? One, yeah. I definitely would not mind giving you a little bit of experience. And I would also love to grab some siege equipment somewhere. So maybe we should get another place where we can... Uh, maybe we should create another place where we can get siege equipment instead of just here. Would love to do it here as well, but we don't have the space for it. Anyway, how's the deal here? Like, what's the deal here? Are we, are we also in the same situation with this army? So I would like to have you at the front line, you at the front line. I think that is fine. But I would not mind pulling out a couple more armies. Let's just start moving you down south and start doing this again. Because we have a full stack over here too. You're ill uh, for some reason. Hmm. Yeah, maybe we'll put you back in the uh, city then. That's not going to be good for public order though. And public order is not great here. It's minus 16. Well, let's at least have them winter. Does that even matter? Like, No, it doesn't matter. Okay, in that case, I'm, I'm taking you out. Let's control this region. Uh, and you should be there. Oh, God, look at that. 
Well, we can defend against them. Okay, so we've got one army here, which should be ready to take this. Then we've got another army here, which should be ready to take this, but you can't do it alone. So I need you here, I think. And then also, worth mentioning, nobody's doing something at Rodos. So that is also something that we need to do. We need to figure out a way to um, to get that siege in Rodos going. And I think it's going to have to be this army. Because that is a nice army. This is this is a nice army. So let's let's use it. I was kind of using it for public order for a bit, but I think we should. Uh, I think we should be fine on that front. And also, I am pulling this legion out of here. It's going to start moving all the way over to Greece and uh, be there for a while. And maybe this army as well. And then we have one army here, one army here. We'll have one here and we'll have another one over here. And I think that is a nice little bit of a border zone. And then I'd like to have one army stationed in Greece and the rest can be put to use in the war. Let's have these two... Let's see if they get some replenishment. Yeah, they are getting replenishment again. They are getting a replenishment again. That's annoying. Well, it's not annoying, but... Oh. Okay, you start moving to the oasis here. You probably need to stay here for a bit. Get public order under control there. And then these two, I will start moving back again, I guess. <laughs> Yeah, let's just move him back again. With a little bit of luck, they're going to be able to get to this city. Not next turn. We don't need them there next turn. Public order here is fine. So what you're doing is not, like, helping. Let's start the first actions against Egypt. I think we can. And we need to talk about construction soon. Oh, no. Stop it. We need to talk about construction soon here. Yeah, I need I need this army here to uh, help out with the siege of Rodos. Uh, and we have a supply ship. Good. Okay. Uh, onwards. Onwards. Forwards with the goat. That is a Dutch saying which doesn't work in English at all. I am sorry. Forwards with the goat. <laughs> I like it though. I like it. Forwards with the goat. Let's keep it in. Forwards with the goat. My god, I'm going to use that. I'm going to use that more often. Um. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Ugh. Just stretching. <sighs> Pre battle stretch. Do we have a fleet coming in? No, right? I don't think we have a fleet. No, we don't have a fleet coming in. Well, they have a fleet, a garrison fleet. That's it. That's the issue. That's why we are seeing a bit of the um, bit of the sea as well. Okay, fine. We'll just kill the fleet too. We have siege equipment. Keep that in mind. Uh, the siege equipment is going to be able to, like, we're going to be able to funnel them through a uh, through a choke point. We'll have the mercenaries be a first line there. Uh, mer the mercenaries and the um, the auxiliary, I guess. And then we'll have the, uh, the 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 legionaries on the flanks, or maybe not on the flanks. I don't know. We'll see. We'll funnel them through a gap, though. The artillery will do uh, quite a number on them, if all is well. This is a bit of a wide gap. I'd rather have something a bit more narrow. Like this one, maybe. Still going to go out from that one, but it doesn't... Still still pretty much fine. We need to... I want to see what their range is. Wow. Look at that range. Okay, well. Looks like we're going back a bit then. So I want to fire here. Fire 
Pokemon. Okay, that's the first cohorts. Something like this. It's fine. As you May need to move forward. Which is something that I'm not really loving. They're going to try and uh, land their the troops there first, I think. What we could do is just get some cavalry on their behinds. I'm going to move forward a little bit. Nobody should fire at will. With a little bit of luck, the cavalry is going to be able to, uh... Yeah, there we go. Okay. Ballista! Okay, let's see if this works. Yep. Same spot, just keep firing. I'm just going to have it keep firing. I'm going to have them keep firing. That's the next. That is a nice bit of damage again. Very good. Uh, I wouldn't mind pushing the cavalry into that. We'll see. Yep, nice. That is nice. Look at the kills moving up. Very good. I'm gonna have him keep firing. We await orders. Beautiful. Now would be the time to uh, really get in there. And they will, they will, they will. Yep, there's the next volley. That is beautiful. Look at that. That is beautiful. We'll keep firing that gap. Keep pushing in the gap. Sure, let them fire that. That's fine. Because now the armored units need to get through. Come on. Give me the next volley. There we go. Okay. Now we have shields, we should... Uh, that's not looking great though. Okay, let's have them... Uh... Okay, fire that. It's decent. Okay, here we go. Uh, we're firing at will with these guys. I don't want that. Okay, let me get you out of this. The Studox. This is not look. Uh, that that way, please. Okay, we're moving into the flanks with you. Block that gap. Block that gap. You there. What are you firing at? Ah, that's fine. Okay, we don't really have much cavalry to deal with all their missile troops. So that is a bit of an issue. I'm going to push you through here, though. Units has used all its ammunition. 
Let's pull the Studos there. Let's make sure that the Studo holds. Okay, they are gonna hate this. They're gonna drop like flies there. Same over here. Let's see if we can maybe do a little bit more of that. We're in Testudo, by the way, so we are tanking a lot of those missiles. Keep that in mind. That flank should be done. Start pushing into that. First cohort is moving in. Uh, I'm not sure whether I like that. I need them to chase that. How are we doing? Oh yeah, nice, nice. That's nice. Yeah, this is fine. This is good. They're in the studio, so... Turn. I'm not going to push the first cohort in just yet, I think. Okay, let's work on that general. We've got them. We've got them. Let's make sure we have that Testudo up. That's good. Okay, I think this is a pretty nice battle so far. Get that general. The woods. Back. I think this is pretty nice so far. What is this? These are just archers. I like the way how we, we are keeping the Romans out of the fight. I like that. I like that. I also like the way how we... Um, how we deal with the missiles here. Ready and waiting. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Proud Romans all. Legionaries. Advance at speed. Sons of Mars. Okay, let's get these two out. Uh, you're actually there, so let's do something about this. These men are wavering, that is all fine. Let's actually get the general a little bit closer to uh, provide them some support. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Yeah, because this is all done. Uh, you're going to move forward. You're going to move forward. You are actually tangling with archers, which is horrible for them. Uh, these legionaries can start moving back a bit. Uh, hold that line for Rome, buddy. For bloody Rome. There we go. First cohort is tanking a million missiles. Yeah, I'm loving this. I'm loving that. They are taking casualties, though. So, nearly impenetrable, they say, eh? Nearly impenetrable to missile damage. Well, not, not as nearly impenetrable as they think. Not as nearly impenetrable as they think. Look at that. Look at the dropping. That is not good enough. There. Don't let him get away. Yeah, this is not as nearly impenetrable as they think. I might take him out in a bit. It's time to get some legionaries involved. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Yeah, this is this is just horrible. Get out of the the studio. Uh, no, don't get out of that. That's just gonna make things worse. That is just gonna make things worse. We'll not do that. Uh, we got this right. Yeah, good. Okay. Our men flee the field of battle. Fold in. Just fold in. Oh, right side. Don't don't pretend that. Don't, don't expose that right side. You go there. Okay, we're moving nice into that flank, though. 
I'm gonna start moving the God. That. Start moving those legionaries in. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Yeah, well, it was to be expected. Now we just need to catch their bloody cavalry. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Okay, yeah, well, that Testudo did not do what I hoped it would. Um, but that is fine. That is fine. Sometimes you need to try something. No, you go here. That is nice, we're in. Let's see if we can get them to rout. That is a curious little formation there. Okay, we've got them back in, that's good. Let have, let's have you chase that. All of you need to get into here. Make sure they don't get away. Uh, let's get the general close for a little second. Yes, and make sure that this guy rounds. Don't think we lost too many legionaries on this one. We got them, right? Yeah, we got them. Not really liking the whole chasing them down thing. Uh, let's swing that first cohort here, over to here. So we have a flank exposed here, and we have a flank exposed there. Uh, let's go for this one, then. Yes, let's get in. No, 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 don't let them leave, don't let them leave. Come on. I'm loving this. We should be there, though. Um, they're done. That's good. Get in. Push, push, push. Come on. Let them leave. Don't let them leave. Do not let them leave. We'll have them take that. These can take care of that. Ah, so annoying. They run like that. Okay, did we get them? We got them, good. Okay, this is it, good. <clears throat> a close victory, we've lost. No, uh, we did about as well as the auto-resolve, I think. Yeah, this is about as good as the auto-resolve. Well, we, we have lost a lot of men, but we haven't... We Right, that is, the, that, that is the difference, right? We have lost a lot of men, but it was up to us to decide which men to lose, right? Which men we've, we, we wanted to lose on this one. Uh, and we have lost, well, quite a few men, but mainly these auxiliary, uh, auxiliary, auxiliary troops. Right, it's, it's these tribes people that we've lost, and these, well, a little bit more armored. I think the Greek soldiers. I don't know. But we did not lose a lot of legionnaires. Uh, we didn't lose, you know, artillery. We didn't lose a lot of cavalry. We lost a lot of the first cohort, though, because that Testudo did not do what I wanted, uh, what I wanted it to do. Um, and look at the kills on these guys. My goodness, that is so bloody amazing. Right, see you in a bit. Alrighty, a close victory. Fine. It's fine, I'll take it. Let's occupy this settlement. That is the first bit of Parthian territory that we're taken, I believe. What is that? The Watch. Well, we are not at war with them, so... Right. 
Okay, well that's good. Um, that is a good victory. Let's make sure this all is set to what it should be. Let's dismantle that. Don't need that. Uh, let's not get into construction just yet. We want to go, I think, towards Koron with this army. What is that? That is Bithynia. They don't stand a chance, so I think we move towards Koron with this, this legion and we'll try and delay this army as much as we can. I think that is what we need to do here. There's going to be a revolt here as well. So maybe this army will do something about that? I'm not sure. Well, it could. It could. If we don't station them inside of the city, that does leave them vulnerable. Because we don't know what the Parthians have in this settlement. Uh, but we could get them into a fort. I think. No, we can't get them into a fort. We don't have the movement range. Okay, I'll get back to that in a bit. Let's merge these troops and see if we can maybe get some decent legionnaires out of this. We can't. Uh, we do need more cavalry, so let's take a bit. Uh, let's grab a, a little bit of cavalry on that. I would not mind having some archers on this, so let's grab them for now, and maybe we can get some of these decent... Well, we'll get some, we'll grab some more horsemen, I guess, for now. I would like to have some replenishment on this legion, but it does look like that is not going to happen. Uh, this legion needs to stay here for a bit. Let's start moving towards this border zone here and get into a fort. You're already in a fort, so that is good. Okay, so Armavir is actually the next target, I believe. Asa Mosata, Tushpa and Koron. So we're going to be able to get rid of those uh, those rebels. That is not going to be an issue. That is not going to be an issue. Public order here is a bit of an issue though. There's going to be a legion moving towards that very quickly. Public, public order there is a bit of an issue. Let's uh, take a look at these provinces because uh, we need to remedy that. Government reform is... Uh, gov yeah, the government reform is still a bit of an issue. Ev events, look at that, minus 18. That is, that is horrible. Owning factions, cultural influence, that is very good. Take that. And then we had uh, in Kireni, I believe, we have a couple of slums developing, so let's do something about that as well. Just take a forum and we'll take another forum. Because we don't want slums to develop. We don't want that. It's not good for public order. Minus 15 in Carthage, in Africa. It's quite a bit. Uh, did we go over everything? I think we did. Let's check politics before we start constructing. So we have another faction now. It's actually looking pretty decent. Uh, how much for that? Yeah, let's let's have that go down one more turn. Have we declared an heir? That was also, yeah, we need to declare an heir. That was also something mentioned in the comment section. Thank you for that. I think Rala is going to be a good heir. I think Rala is going to be a good heir. You need to get married. Oh, no. Uh, how much for organizing games? Let's organize some games. With a little bit of luck, we'll get public order under control a little bit more. 
Yeah, that did do quite a bit. That did do quite a bit. So maybe we'll do the same in uh, in Thrace. Let's see how much that would cost us. I'll do it. Yeah, that, that makes a difference. Uh, what is the taxes at at the moment? So we can always choose not to tax them as well. My god, we have such an empire. My goodness. Such a large empire already. Okay, well, this all looks good, I guess. Um, don't think we need to move anything else. Let's just see what we can do here. You don't have a lot of food in this province. Uh, what happens if we do... That is more Celtic culture. How's Rome doing? Let's get that to the next level. Okay, that's going to be fine. Food-wise, we need more here anyway, so... Uh, then here... Let's uh, no. Let's 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 look at a couple of other provinces first, because uh, this one, for example, I'd like to look at this first. This can be a medicus, and this needs to construct stuff. Uh, let's get wine and let's get that, and then that probably doesn't need to be that. Uh, I'd probably want that to be something food related. Okay, we're out of money. We are out of money. Okay, let's go to the next turn, I think. Uh, we could take a quick look at diplomacy. Welcome. I throw open. Yeah, you're, you're a client state. I know. You're a client state as well. No, no. You're a military. No, you're a client state. Am I always to be disturbed? Uh, we want to keep fighting Rodos. Okay, let's go to the next turn. E the fight with Egypt is going to happen quite soon. It's going to be spring next turn, by the way, which is good as well. How much time do we have? I've got about five more minutes on the clock, but I will keep playing for a little bit longer, because I am... Um... Well, I'm... I'm, I'm... I'm enjoying it. <laughs> I'm enjoying it, so let's keep playing for a little bit longer. We can make this episode a little bit longer, right? I hope you guys won't mind. Don't think you would. Maybe call it quits on the next start, because we have we we've we fought one battle this this episode. We've not really been doing much, so let's just keep moving forward. It is 231 BC at the moment. Which is going to be 232 BC, I guess, on the next turn. I don't know when the uh, when the turn of the year is happening. Whether that is autumn to winter or winter to uh, winter to spring. But we'll see. 231 BC. That is, I mean, that is pretty early. We are pretty pretty ahead on this thing. I think I need to refresh. We are very much ahead. Yeah, we are absolutely ahead. Okay, they don't want to fight us. That is a good thing. Hopefully they don't declare war. Because I would not like to fight this army right now. Uh, our next target is probably going to be this settlement over here. I forgot the name of it. Let's see what the Parthians are up to. They might bring this fleet over to, uh, to this settlement over there. Which... Might be it might be a good time to get another fleet in into this bit of uh, territory because well we'll have to check if this is an admiral then I'm not that worried oh bro that is that is fine some agent activity from the Rodos is fine 
As long as they don't assassinate the, um, the Legatus there, I guess. Now, that army is not going to be able to move, which is a good thing. We need to keep that army uh, poisoned. We need to, to make sure their movement is hindered. The bravery of men, not words, is all that is between us now. We shall have okay, they are not joined by victory. Egypt. We are untrustworthy for, for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why. Uh, but this means that the next war is is already upon us. And I'm not sure why we are untrustworthy. I'm not sure when that happened. But at least we're not fighting Egypt. That is fine by me. Although we, we, we can handle it. We can take him. We can absolutely take him on. Why are we untrustworthy? Can someone point that out in the comment section, please? Because I don't... I don't really understand that one. I don't really understand why we are untrustworthy now. What did we do to make us untrustworthy? I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna shut off the timer here. It's, uh, it's, it's about to go off. Now, usually this is a pretty long start turn thingy. Let's try and refresh this, see if that helps. Don't think it will. I think we just need to be patient. Yeah. Uh, I'll take Inspired Endeavors. Absolutely. Character's mission is ended. That is fine, I guess. Character's mission is ended. Uh, extreme unhappy. Okay, there's the rebellion in Tushpa. That's good. Um, attrition report. Quite a bit of attrition. Garrison army. So that is because of winter. And then we have a lot of unseasonal conditions. Quite a few unseasonal conditions. Construction report. Quite a bit of construction as well, which is very good. Character trait. Uh, quartermaster. Quite a bit of recruitment. Inspired populace. Unhappy populace. Trouble populace. Faction encountered. Call of the Noi. Okay. Right, Caledonia. That is fine. Got a hidden agent exposed. That is all fine. It's all fine. Um, I want to see what the dealers have been brought. Yeah, this is look at public order. That is probably because of some kind of event. Uh, I'm happy with that. It means that I will start moving this army out of here because we don't need them here anymore. We need them in Greece. So I'm going to need you to start moving over to there. In the meantime, I will probably start recruiting some troops for this legion. And the same applies to the one I'm moving over here. <coughs> Let's start moving you over as well. So I'll need them somewhere else. I wouldn't mind some more cavalry on each uh, legion, so let's do that. Okay, that's two more legions on the way, which is always a very good thing. Uh, we are now... I'm, I'm really unsure why we were untrustworthy. I wish... I wish we... Uh, well, maybe it was a while ago and I missed it. Maybe it wasn't even this episode. Probably was another episode. Now, we have war with these guys, so we should do something about that. Uh, let's go for agent activity first. We have you. Let's see if we can get there. Are we going to be able to get there? No, because we'll have to go through the other route. We can't get through here. I will actually go through here. I want to see what they are uh, up to. I'm not going to move them yet. Uh, we do need to probably fight them. Do we have siege equipment on this army? Or do we have another way to delay them? That could also work. We have siege equipment on this army. So in theory we could... Fight them. Now we are close to Mazaka. But I'd rather get rid of this army. So that is something that needs to happen. And that is probably a battle that I will not fight today. Okay, we need to take care of the rebels. So, let's get these men to Tushpa. We're getting replenishment, finally. Now, they're going to rout, which means that we are not going to be able to... catch them. So, we'll move to Tushpa and we'll just secure this border for a bit. I mean, we could push them, I guess, but what's the point? Are you getting replenishment? I hope so. No. 
Okay, agents first. I will do anything for Rome. Moving out. Attack and attack. The gods honor me with success. At your service. As you command. Is there nothing else? Okay. At yours. What do you wish of me? Mischief. I that is so nice. How may I serve on the road again? All right, no threats here, which is good. Start moving down south a bit. A shadow I wish we had a spy here now, but we don't. That is an admiral. Okay, let's get them into the waters. Start moving towards the Rodos. Actually, do a four here as well. Okay, that's fine. Um, I want another fleet. We can definitely get another navy, so that's not going to be an issue. You're better. Uh, I need you. Um, hmm. It's fine. It's fine. If we leave Trapezos, they're going to use the uh, fleet to take it, so I don't want that. We should be able to recruit some legionnaires. Right? Yeah. That is good. We'll grab it. Then you need to stay here. Now they could start moving towards Koron. If they do that, that is fine. I'd say that is fine. You need to stay where you are. This fleet needs to stay where they are. need to start fighting them again at some point. We hunger for battle. And we have no more replenishment. That is so annoying. We had it last turn, so I'm not sure why we don't have it this turn anymore, but it's okay. <clears throat> Egypt should really be scratching their head here. Like, they should really be starting... They should really start sending some troops over to this border. Because they literally see, you know, 20,000 Romans at their border, so... <laughs> they should be questioning this. They definitely should be questioning this. They definitely should be questioning that. Okay, here's what we need to do. We need to fight this battle. But that is not something that we're going to do this episode, my friends. That is not something that we're going to do this episode. Let's do construction. Let's make everything ready to go to the next turn. Um, so that we can go to the next turn quickly in the in the, uh, in the, ne in the next episode. Uh, I want to go over all of the legions real quick. 
I want to go all over all of the all of the legions to see whether they are doing what they should. You are definitely doing what you should. Any any decent mercenaries? No, not really. We need you here. What is the upkeep cost on uh, these guys? Yeah, too much. Okay, never mind. Uh, we'll keep you in the patrol stance. Hey, look, you're 15. You need to stay where you are. Yep, that is all good. That is all good. Yes. You need to stay where you are as well. These are all taking bloody attrition, which is fine. We'll be ready if they come. We'll be able to take them on. Okay, we've got two more legions moving uh, moving towards the... Uh, two more legions moving towards Greece and Asia. This is all looking very good. Fun how we can move him in that in that uh, stance. I like that. Yeah, but this is all looking very good. So I'm I'm very happy with all this. Do we want this legion to be a full legion as well? Might as well make it a full legion. We have the money for it. Why not? Right. I'd like to have one more of these. Might as well make it a full legion. If they try something, then we'll be ready for them. So we have we have nothing with the like we have no pacts with them we have nothing with them. Uh, what we do need to figure out is if we look at the victory conditions that we need to have Darcia. We don't have Darcia at the moment, so we need to be on good terms with the Apulli, or we need to make them into a client state. We could maybe just pay for that. I have no stomach for the meek or nice. Maybe not. So that means that we might need to go for one more war over there. That is fine. I mean, we'll be able to. to listen if you speak we'll be honestly. able to take them out Truth, pretty quickly. That is not going to be an issue. Oh. Uh, Bithynia, are you ready to Greetings. go to peace already? No. I don't really want to go to peace with them anyway. Uh, the Isenia, I would, sure no, I would not mind trading with them. They don't want to do that. Uh, that is fine. I would like to go to peace with you. I, I don't here. care about this war. Then we have Parthia, of course. My Sia as well. You oh. have my attention. Speak. And try to we are untrustworthy well. again. What the hell? Does that uh, depend on culture and such as well? Let's take a quick look. Yeah, we're trustworthy to uh, the, the Dari. How are we doing with the Isaini? Trustworthy as well. So... Hmm. I mean, Mycia is willing to go to Be peace with us. And may but we're going to have to ask ourselves, do we want to go to peace with my... Uh, actually, if they become a client state... Well, I don't really want them to be a client state anyway. I want to take their territory, so... I am here, then. Speak your words, and be sure that I find profit in them. I don't really care about fighting the Parthians. Rhodes will want to peace out with us. Now, Egypt doesn't like us. It would be Man, wonderful. our history with Egypt is so long as well. They were basically the reason we won the war against Massalia, right? <laughs> Egypt was the war we uh, e Egypt was the reason we we won the war against Massalia. That is pretty insane, and that is so long ago. My goodness. Uh, right, we need to build stuff here. Uh, that and what is that? Fishing boats. Let's get some fish. I can always use more fish. I guess. Let's get even more fish. Needs to be three. That need, needs to be three. Could get that to four, but I don't really want to do that. Don't really want to invest in this province anyway. I'm not sure why I'm doing it. Um, let's take a look at something else first. Uh, actually, let's take a look at Greece. Because that, what is that? That's going to give us something. 
Yeah, more military research rate as well. That is pretty good. Especially since we're going into the military tree now. It's 18,000. I'll, I'll take it. I'll take it. Take a uh, temple to Jupiter as well. Let's get that. Less regional income. Taxes for building upkeep. I'm always a bit wary when it comes to upgrading um, temples and such. But maybe we should do it more often. Gonna give more food, more squalor, but I mean, squalor is covered. Food, uh, a little bit less public order. Three more, or sorry, two more food. It's gonna cost us six food, but it's gonna give us three more public order, which is not as much as I hoped it would be. It's gonna give us five more food, but six less in public order. A little bit more squalor. A little bit less in public order, less food, more squalor, more growth, though. Wish this gave more public order. Uh, that is something that we need, though. Let's grab that as well. Get, get it to the next turn. It's going to give some more food. Let's check the politics first, actually. Something that we really should not forget. Civil War would be like a bloody catastrophe right now. Right, only 3k now. Uh, I'm going to have it decline a little bit further. It's going to give us one more food. Let's just do that. It's fine. It will leave us with 4,000. Uh, we can actually upgrade this for 4,000. Uh, do I want this here? I'd rather have a library. How's Empire maintenance anyway? 60.5. Let's switch those. Start switching those. Alright, we are going to call it quits though. Uh, but we're going to call it quits fighting this army. Let's take a look here. Do we get reinforcements from Ankara? Maybe. Okay. Okay, so here's the thing. They have... What's that? My goodness, they look pretty decent. Uh, they have a bit of an advantage. They do have a bit of an advantage. But we have siege equipment. And they, they are actually stuck in a fort. So they are going to try and... <laughs> they're basically going to try and all punch through the... Uh, through the opening there, which is where we are going to be able to fire at them with the artillery, which is going to do a number on them. So I'm absolutely happy with that. This legion is pretty decent. We'll get a victory here. We'll have a victory here. But for now, we're going to call it quits, my friends, because we have had a pretty beautiful episode, I do think. Yeah, it's going to... It's time. It's time. I'm going to have to call it quits. I'd love to fight this battle. Absolutely, absolutely love to fight this battle. But... It's going to be the start of the next. My friends, for now, I bid you farewell. Thank you very much for being here with me today, and I absolutely hope to catch you on the next. Thank you. Bye-bye.